everyone, it's Christina of Crafty Paws. I'm here to share a collective haul with you guys. I don't always come on and do haul videos, but I've been getting some really great deals online and I wanted to share them with you just so you guys are aware of different places to get awesome deals on crafty products. So this first little haul was actually a haul from a D stash and I bought these from Jess C here on YouTube and they're super cute little tiddly ink stamps. I think both of these might be retired, but Jess had a great price on these. I think they were like $15, including shipping from Canada. And I just think they're so stinking cute. I love tiddly inks and I love the way she illustrates these cute little images. And I love <laughs> that this has the little skulls with the bows on it. This one says bad to the bone. I, I mean, you can't get cuter than that, right? <laughs> the next little haul I got from Cali Craft Supplies. And Barbara has had a different kind of store. Now she does more of a planning store. But so she had this in her old store and she sold both of these dies. This is a Tim Holtz Thinlets dies that has these great different background textures. And this is a Prima Diet that's a vintage clock, and I love both of these. So this was a great do at $20, including shipping. The next stamps that I purchased were from Top Flight Stamps, and I found out about this company from Sandy Alnock. She was sharing some cards that she was making with these two cute uh, stamp sets, and Top Flight Stamps is a newer store, online store in the U.S. that sells a lot of international stamp sets for really great prices. And she was having a sale for 20% off on this particular brand, Ketzelcraft. And I actually think this is so similar to the Tim Holtz Crazy Dogs, Crazy Cats, Crazy Things stamp sets. And I don't know what came first, but I love all of these images. So I jumped on it. Even though she was out of stock because Sandy shares and then everybody wants them, <laughs> she was kind enough to extend the 20% off. And when she got this back in stock, she was quick to mail these right off to me. So I picked up this one, which is their version of like crazy things. I think it's called uh, Funny Accessories. And I just think these are so great. The illustrations on these are fabulous. This is the Ketzelcraft cats. And I think the expressions on these kitties are so funny. And this is the Ketzelcraft dogs. And I mean, look at these expressions. They are so, so cute. Sorry for the glare. And I think she has an amazing store. I also decided to pick up the clouds background stamp. And these are all red rubber stamps. They're not mounted, so you can either use like the adhesive, the stick it over and over, or you can mount them onto foam uh, cushioning, which is what I normally do with unmounted red rubber stamps. But the images that get stamped out are fabulous once you mount them or once you use um, the stick it over and over adhesive and use the acrylic blocks. And then I also picked up this Home Sweet Home stamp set by Joy Crafts. And I just think this will be great to do little scenes. It has a sofa, a chair, a little table. This one wasn't on sale, but I just loved it. So I went ahead and picked that up. And again, I think this is from the Netherlands, the company itself, Joy Crafts. And this was a great do. All of these stamp sets all together, including shipping, was just under $53. And then lastly, you guys know I love the greeting farm and I missed out on the Halloween kit. And when I emailed the owners of the greeting farm and asked if they would consider re-releasing this stamp set and putting it on the farmer's market, you know, that's the sale that they have every quarter. They were super sweet, immediately responded and said, actually they have one of these stamp sets without the face card for $40 instead of the normal 48. So I jumped on it. Uh, it wasn't actually even visible, the, as far as I could tell, in the sales section, but they responded, and so I quickly bought it, and super, super sweet. Pinkalicious Scrapper here on YouTube was kind enough to 
let me know that she actually had the stamp set with the face card and she's going to make a color copy of it for me. I'm so, so eternally grateful uh, because what I do is I take the face card, I laminate it, and then I adhere and store all of these kit stamps like the bloom kit stamp i see how i've laminated it it's a tech it's a storage technique that i learned from sarah who's sarah elliott here on youtube and i absolutely love it and then the foam you know cling sticks right on that lamination and it's really easy to store this way so i can't wait to cut this up once i get the laminated uh face card and i'm so excited that i was able to finally pick up this halloween kit especially for 20% off. And that's it. That's my recent hauls. I hope you guys are having a wonderful crafty day. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.